Hi folks, this is Max from DroidRazorRoot.com. Um, so, if you want to turn your Droid Razor into a Samsung phone because you hate uh, Moto Blur, then you can with the right uh, Red Tide uh, Revenge AOKP ROM. This thing is awesome. This is what I'm running right now. Uh, it actually is Jelly Bean AOKP ROM, but it comes with TouchWiz UX launcher as you can see here. Um, so you get the best of TouchWiz and also a lot of st uh, cool stuff like Awesome Beats and uh, also you can just install if you don't like the launcher if you get tired of it you can always install Nova Launcher Apex Launcher off the market it will work just fine and you get all the latest AOKP features um, stuff like uh, show notification count um, so you can see the number of notifications up there and kill all button hold back to kill um, so I hold down uh, this button and I can kill it all so it's great because it's a very nice mix of uh, TouchWiz UX from uh, the Samsung Galaxy S3 into the Droid Razor and you get all these uh, AOKP features which also work just fine with it um, so you, for the lock screen you can use the AOKP lock screen you can also choose up to eight different targets here if you change uh, some of these stuff here and uh, let me see here um, also lock screen uh, rotation also works so it's a fully AOKP ROM that allows you to take advantage um, you can't unlock it that way by the way <laughs> that's a bug um, you you know it's a fully AOKP ROM with TouchWiz UX running I've never seen something like this even on a Galaxy S3 but it's available now and also the LED feature is awesome on the AOKP um, right now I've got like my Gmail set to um, red color there you can test the LED here turn it off and you'll see the red LED there so I have um, red for Gmail I've got Twitter I've got um, kind of bluish uh, blue color there and uh, you know you can set it for all kinds of different uh, apps and you know you can get LED notification notifications on your phone without turning your phone on and uh, for performance, um, it's actually at 1.35. Um, I think that's fine. I think that's it's a little bit overclocked. Um, that should be fine. But the performance of this phone is really fast, and also you do get some cool Samsung widgets like this, or the weather weather widget if you like it. So it's it's a really nice ROM. I, I think this is one of the most fun ROMs. Maybe not the best ROM, but it's well, it, maybe it is the best ROM. Uh, but it's really fun and uh, also it does come with the Apex Launcher if you don't like TouchWiz um, but very nice also for the camera um, it does have the same bug as, as all the other Jelly Bean um, you know phones have right now which is the flash isn't working um, so that's a bug so if you know that's something you gotta live with until the developers get to fix it but a uh, very nice ROM very nicely implemented um, certainly a nice uh, feature, nice fun feature to have TouchWiz running. You know, turn your Droid Razor into a Galaxy S3 today. Uh, check it out and let me know what you think about this ROM. And uh, um, I think that's it. So if you like this video, um, please hit that like button for me here. Subscribe button up there if you have. Thanks a lot. And if you have a Droid Razor, uh, don't forget to sign up for my email list at droidrazorroot.com. Um, we work all day long to find you best ROMs and send you round the week once a week and also it's a great way for you to get in contact with me and others if you have trouble with your phone and uh, stay high on android and check out the red tide revenge rom and don't forget to donate to the developer i'll try to find a link um, alright see y'all later